Hello friends, it's Sujit Vag. You are watching Wikinote channel. Welcome to the Triple E question answer video tutorial series. So dear friends, in this video we are going to study about the question explain the functions related with analog input as well as output pins of Arduino microcontroller. So this question weightage is 6 marks. It is also asked in the exam twice in the previous exams. The expected answer of this question is there are three functions which are related with analog input output operations of Arduino. So two operations belongs to analog input out input function and one operation related with analog output function. So two operations are analog read and analog reference. In case of analog output, only single function that is analog write. So we are going to explain the analog read and analog reference first and after that the analog write function. So don't confuse between analog input and output function as it carries six marks. So three function each will carry two marks. Their explanation will carry two marks. So we, we, are, we are going to explain this functions. So let's start. Please do subscribe the YouTube channel Wikinote Foundation and click the bell icon to receive notifications of new uploaded videos. The first analog input function is analog read. So what is significance of this analog read function? So mostly, sorry, what is significance of this analog read function? So you have to write the answer in this format. First, you have to write down the description of the function. This function is used to read the analog input voltage between 0 to 5 volt as this is analog input voltage this function is going to read the voltage value between 0 to 5 volt and will convert this value this value into decimal value that will range from 0 to 1023 now why this value see here mostly this function is used in case of internal adc of atmega 328p microcontroller so analog input voltage is 0 to 5 volt and this voltage gets converted into the 0 to 1023 decimal number for 0 volt analog input voltage the value will be 0 in decimal for 5 volt input voltage analog input voltage the value will be 1023 and suppose the voltage value is 2.5 volt that is midway between this then the value will be 512 decimal so now you can see as i am varying the input voltage value from 0 to 5 volt its value is going to vary according to this table as your internal adc is 10 bit adc so that's why 2 raised to 10 will give rise to 10 1024 so that means the maximum value here it would be 1024 and as it starts from 0 so final value will be 1023 but no need to discuss this in more detail just you have to write down the description it is used to read the analog input voltage value between 0 to 5 volt and will convert this value into decimal value 0 to 1023 just write down this statement then how to write its syntax it is written in this fashion int val is equal to analog read now see how i have written analog read or everything is in small letters just r is capital and this value will be stored into the value variable whose data type is int so here you have to write down the pin number from which you are going to read the data so in the example part i would like to explain this with the help of example suppose int val is equal to analog read 
in bracket pin number digital pin uh, mostly analog pins are used here as this is belongs to analog functions a0 so whatever input analog input voltage at a0 pin that will be read by this function and it will get converted into the value 0 to 1 0 to 3 and will get stored into this value variable so in the exam it is expected you should write down the description of the function its syntax and then followed by example now we'll go for the next analog input function and that is nothing but analog reference so what happens in this case i would explain and the format will be same now don't change the format write down the your answers in this fashion only so that you will get full marks for the attempted question and its answer so description analog reference or everything is in small r is capital so its description is it is used to select used to select a reference voltage type voltage type so this a reference voltage type how to write its syntax so syntax is simple analog reference in bracket type so for example suppose i am writing analog reference in bracket default so there are there can be different types such as default internal related with at mega uno board but don't go in more detail reference voltage so it is going to select the default reference voltage that is of 0 to 5 volt either or it can also go for 0 to 3.3 volt it, it is based on the arduino board which you are using or you can go for the internal reference voltage of 1.1 volt also so in the description just write down it is used to select the reference voltage type syntax analog reference and the type of the voltage reference and the, in the example i have explained this with the help of example now we'll go ahead with analog output function so before that i will just rub this part so this is very important function that is analog output function analog output function as discussed it has one function that is analog write so what is use of this analog write function it is used to generate pwm waveform at digital pins d3 d5 d6 d9 d11 and d12 now see you will ask why digital pins only because arduino will provide us the facility this d3 d5 d6 d9 d11 and d12 can able to produce the pulse width modulated waveforms pulse width modulated means they are going to generate a pwm waveform which is used to control the speed of dc motor 25 percent duty cycle 50 percent duty cycle it may be the 75 percent duty cycle so what is the syntax of this analog write function this function is most widely used so its function data syntax is like this analog write c write in this format only everything is small w is capital it has its own meaning that is inbuilt functions of arduino id so analog write in bracket pin number comma duty cycle value so example suppose i am writing analog write pin number digital pin number suppose 5 i am taking and dc value suppose i am writing 255 so its meaning is you are going to generate a pwm waveform of 100 percent duty cycle in order to know more about this function uh, function you have one formula that is for 100 percent duty cycle you have to load the value of 255 so suppose i have to generate a duty cycle of 25 percent then what value should i load here so if you consider it as an x 
so x multiplied by 100 25 into 255 so it gives rise to the value of 63 approximately so if you are loading this value into this function so this function is going to generate a duty cycle of 25 percent on the digital pin 5 so in the exam it is expected that as the analog input output function there are three types for analog input analog read and analog reference and for analog output analog write function so every function will carry two marks each provided that you should write the answer of this question answer in this format description then syntax and then example thanks for watching this video stay tuned for more such videos please like and share this video with your friends also refer my website wikinote.org follow us on our facebook page wikinote foundation the links for the same are provided in the description box below